everyone. I'm Donna Bush with your CIG TV News Update. Thanks for joining us. We hear more about the UCCI Caribbean 100 conference that is days away. UCCI professor Dr. Livingston Smith has more. Well, I really want to encourage persons who are listening to me to come out on Wednesday evening for the reception. When you come out there, you can get registered. We'll have all the machine in place for you to be registered for the event for Thursday and Friday. Um, but if you want to do it now, that's even better. You can go to the website, it's www.uccaconference.ky and download the, the form and get registered. Uh, it's a Caribbean conference and therefore we are bringing together um, in Cayman uh, quite a number of, of leaders in, in, in politics, in the media, in the church, um, from the education system because we, we are insisting that this conference, even though there's a significant aspect of it that deals with um, government, um, ethics has to do with every facet of society. So we are looking at the education system, the media, the church, family, and um, everybody ought to be a part of this event, we believe. Again, the UCCI conference begins with a reception next Wednesday evening at 5.30, and it is open to the public. It will be followed by two days of sessions, speeches, presentations, and much more. And only here on CIDTV will you be able to watch the sessions in their entirety on dates to be announced. Another upcoming event is the Entrepreneurship Day Small Business Expo, and many small businesses on the island are gearing up for the second annual Business Expo put on by the Department of Commerce and Investment. Now, attendees will be able to visit booths from various sectors ranging from home improvement to retail. The idea is to help small businesses market their products and services, network and learn from consumers and other business owners. Workshops for small businesses and visiting students is a big pull of the day. Entrepreneurs gain knowledge and insight into important aspects of what it takes to run a small business and to run it successfully. The event starts at 9 a.m. and concludes at 7 p.m. During the course of the day, we have over 30 exhibitors that will be exhibiting. Last year, most of the exhibitors that participated has asked us to reserve their booth again for them this year because it was very vital for their business. They were able to build, to network and to build relationship with other businesses that can complement their own. Again, the Small Business Expo takes place on Entrepreneurship Day at the Family Life Center. That's on Thursday, April the 10th. Finally, this weekend, Scout Week ended in the Cayman Islands, and we took our CIG TV cameras to a campfire as the week wrapped up. Well, we'll have that video for you in just a moment, but first, a reminder about Radio Cayman's Talk Today show. That's weekdays at 12.15 with your host, Sterling Dwayne Ebanks. And remember to watch CIG TV's news update and our rebroadcast throughout the night, or you can go to our Facebook and YouTube pages to watch as well. All right, everyone, that ends today's government news update here on CIG TV. I'm Donna Bush, as always. Thanks for watching. Have a great night. And here's that video of the Scouts' campfire over the weekend. Let's go.